The excitement happens right now on Mari. Explosive paternity stories. <laughs> Shocking DNA results. <laughs> and we're bringing them to you from the hottest spot in the country. <laughs> paternity this hot could only happen during spring break. He didn't want to come here, did he? I had to give him a new pod. <laughs> only our DNA test can settle this beach blanket bed. Michelle slept with her husband's best friend on their wedding night. Is her husband the father? Jasmine's hell-bent on proving Brian's the dad to Brian and his mom. Is he the father? Ah! Red-hot paternity results. Look at that! Look at your babies you and you know it! have no spiritual aura with this baby at all. We're heating things up with some special spring break DNA drama. An incredible hour of Mari starts now. <laughs> Today, we're coming to you from the Weston Diplomat Resort and Spa in Hollywood, Florida. And here, some of our favorite viewers are enjoying one of the most beautiful hotels around. You should really catch this place. It's great. And now, for the next hour, we're going to bring you some of the most outrageous DNA drama. How about that? <laughs> Who could forget Amanda? Amanda didn't know if her ex-boyfriend, Jason, or her other ex-boyfriend, Jamie, was the father of her now three-year-old adorable son, Jaden. Now, around the time that Amanda got pregnant, she was ending her relationship with Jason, starting a new one with Jamie, and says she has no idea which man is the son's father. First, we heard from Amanda. Why is he going like this? He's shaking his head backstage. He's afraid to admit it. Oh, he's is that? A, you know, he's got four kids with four different women. I guess I would be. I guess I'd be a little butt hurt too, coming on national television looking like a fool. You know, Jamie has a girlfriend named Stacy. You know yeah. that? Yeah. Oh, Stacy's I know that. here. She is, huh? Yeah, what, Stacey's what does she, here. What does she need to be here for? We have tried to be in Jaden's life. You've done we what? We haven't seen when? him in two years, when? Amanda. It's been we three tried years. To, no, Stacey, you have been babe. there. Who are you? No. You we, don't know. We've seen him till he was 12 months old, Bo Amanda. Lori. You are, you don't even know. Now let me get this straight. You were going with Jason, you broke up with Jason, you were, right when you were breaking up with Jason, you were with Jamie, but Jamie was there until the baby was how old? Jamie was there until the baby was two months old. He drove me to the hospital when my water broke. He signed the birth certificate. Amanda. <laughs> I, I started dating Jamie Is when he was Is this show about when you? Why are you here? Because it's this We spoke to both Jamie and Jason about this situation before the show, and their feelings about Amanda and her son could not have been more opposite. Watch. My name is Jason, and I could be the father of Amanda's son, Jaden. My name is Jamie, and I do not think that Amanda's son, Jaden, is mine. I was with Amanda for eight and a half years, and we have a 10-year-old son together, and I would be a good father to her son, Jaden. I was with Amanda for over a year, and she cheated on me with Jason, so I think he is the father of Jaden. Jaden looks exactly like Jamie. He has all his features. I have strong genes, and Jaden does not look anything like me. Jaden looks just like Jason, and Amanda knows it, and that's why she had him tested too. I love the family that I have with Amanda. And if I am the father, I would welcome Jaden into my family. I have no connection with Jaden at all. I haven't seen him in over a year because Amanda's kept him away from me. If I was a father, she would want me around and not push me away. So now it was time to bring Jamie out and find out just how hard the situation was for him. Why are you so mad at him? See, he wants 
to sit here acting all tough. Never been there. He ain't no. never been there. Jamie. He wants to walk out here Always like he's some kind of man. Always. The only child you take care of is the one you're with. You don't no. take care of that. No. No. Kids, because he is Amanda. He you may, be, he may be good with your kid, but wait till you leave him too. Because I'm not gonna leave him. I have a ring yeah. on my finger. Good right for here. you. Good for you. Why are you doubting that you're the father? Because she cheated on me. Now we still had to bring Jason out, and remember, he did not share Jamie's enthusiasm about Amanda or her son. Now here's the deal. You all have a child together. He's a good father. He's a wonderful father. And I know. No. How can you be a wonderful dad to a child you don't believe is yours and you don't see? Who do you think the father is of this child? I think it was Jamie, uh, but there's just a possibility that could be mine. Jamie, if you are proved to be the father, ain't you gonna get... be no happy ending, and you go back in the green room and hug and kiss. I will be there for him. I will. No, I will be there for him. Then I'm paying child support for him right for... now. Twenty-three dollars a week. Oh, really? Wow. So, who was the father, Jamie or Jason? I had the paternity results in my hand. When it comes to three-year-old Jaden, Jason, you are not the father. And when it comes to three-year-old Jaden, Jamie, you are the father. This is Cherie. Now, four years ago, Cherie locked eyes with this man, Anthony, fell madly in love. Now, months later, Cherie discovered she was pregnant and says both she and Anthony were overjoyed. But all of that changed five months later when Cherie found out Anthony had secretly another girlfriend. Whoa. That's when Anthony began denying her son, Desmond. First, we heard from Cherie. You told my producer. If you take Desmond, little beautiful. If I turn my son upside down, my son got a little bitty thing and big old, big old beans, little bitty thing, just like him. I taught him if your froggy leap, he dog my creek. And I'm not playing. I'm not playing. He said, one time. One time? He said That's all you... it takes, though. Ain't it? That's right. all it takes. He didn't want to come here, did he? No, he didn't want to come here. I had to give him <laughs> two pods. Push him around. Push him around. Push him around. Push him around. You know something? Woo! I never, bring him out, I never saw bring those coupons out. in a newspaper. You, you ain't seen coupons in the newspaper because I deliver them. <laughs> personally. Now, Anthony, he had a very different story to tell, and his reasons were pretty convincing. Take a look at this. I had sex with Cherie one time, and ever since then, she been hooked on me. She think by pinning her son Desmond on me, we gonna be together, she got another thing coming. She was sleeping with five different guys. She was definitely keeping herself entertained. She need to call one of those dudes and get one of them tested. Cherie dreams about me all the time. She wishes her son had my nose, my lip, my hair, but he has nothing of mine. Cherie, you crazy psycho bitch. When these DNA tests come back and pull him not the father, do me a favor and find you a new obsession. I want it. I want it. I want these results. Oh, is that all you're gonna get? We're gonna get. I'm a million percent sure you my baby. Oh, yeah. 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 Yeah.
Huh? Why, why would she pin that baby on you? I don't know. It don't look like you me. Ain't that baby don't look, do that baby look like me. No, no, it don't. That's not my baby, man. Where did you get that? to get them shoes? That's not me. I need that result. You want to say that when I put my thumb Come on. Now it was time for the paternity test results. Watch this. Anthony, you are the father. Oh, We have more DNA drama down south when we come back. Woo! Eternity this hot could only happen during spring break. Woo! It's two against one. Julius is Tania's father. The two babies look alike. Yes! Look at these babies, bro. Look, they twins. Is he the father of one, Julius? two, Julius? or none? Oh, He's kicked me and our kids out three times. Me? Look at that! Look at your babies you and you know it! Two paternity tests. But is he the father? <laughs> Special spring break DNA drama. Paternity this hot could only happen during spring break. <laughs> now, you remember Shamika and Tiara? These two women joined forces to prove to this man, Julius, that he was the father of both of their beautiful children. Now, these two women were furious with Julius because they both said he loved them. Then he left them. Then he began to deny their kids. Watch. I'm sick and tired of that no good, bitch-ass Julius denying our kids. I am 100% sure that Julius is Terry Adams' father. And I'm 200% sure that Julius is Tania's father. Julius broke both of our hearts. Now he's denying both of our kids. For the last three years, Julius has done nothing for my baby. All Julius has done for my baby is buy her one case of Pampers. Julius has missed every holiday you can name. And today, I'm fed up. Both of our kids look exactly like Julius. They're sisters. He's just too stupid to realize. Today, we're going to prove that he is the father. And he's going to take care of our kids whether he likes it or not. You all work together and then you got pregnant? Yes, I've been knowing this man for 11 years. Like, he was my first. He was my everything. But how could he be my everything when he denied my everything? My baby mean everything to me. That's my pride and joy. I love my baby. That is everything to me. That's, that's all I get. If I let somebody hurt, that would that mean that I'm nothing. The two babies look alike. Yeah. Now it was time to hear why Julius was denying both of these children. Y'all girls need to get it straight. I'm not the father of y'all kids. Shamika, one of your own family members told me I was not tonight's father. You a last shady woman and I don't have time for your games. And you, Tiara, I will always catch you on the phone with other guys. Maybe one of them is the father. Both of y'all are in my business for no reason. And I can't wait till Maury say I hey, am not the father. <laughs> What do you mean? Let him sit right there. Sit right there. Oh. <laughs> Julia, you the father of these babies? No, I'm not. Why you're not? not? No, why, why not? not? If you're not, why not? 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 Why I want to talk to Julius. He ain't got, got nothing to say. Nah, I do got something to say. I do got something to say. And you a liar, you know that. And you is too, and you know that. That's your you're Tiana's father. father. What's the main reason why you think you're not the father yeah, of her child? Because her, I had got a call from her mother, right. and they said she was at this guy house with right. the baby, stressed out with no clothes on, whatever. And then the guy asked her, is this my baby? Tell him this my baby. I was telling her, tell her, ask so him. what I say? You say that's what you said. That's what you said. She said. She said. That's what she said. She said. I asked you. I said, is this his baby or is my baby? You 
you better sit down. That's what you said. That's what you better sit down. Why aren't you the father? Why aren't you the father of Terry Young? Oh, tell me this, because we were still together after the baby was in. So tell me why you ain't the father. We broke up so many times. We did not. Get your goofy ass out of here. No, don't let them down. Hold on. Get your goofy ass out of here. Come on, man. Terry out of eight months. If I was cheap, people say no. You had the baby back. Me, you had the baby back then. Was Julius the father of one, two, or none of these kids? The DNA results were in. When it comes to three-year-old Tanaya, Julius, you are the father. When it comes to eight-month-old Teriana, Julius, you are the father. <laughs> be there for both of my kids. I'm sorry, Tyana. And I'm counting on you. Tonight. And I'm counting on you. And so are all these people who watch this show. They're counting on you to be a good dad. That's all. It's hot down here in spring break, and these paternity stories are even hotter. Now, here's a woman named Tabitha. Came to the show because she had been on and off with her ex-boyfriend, Wesley, for over six years. Now, Tabitha always wanted to be, you know, with family, with Wesley. That is, until she found out, Wesley called the show. Wesley called the show for a DNA test because he was denying her two children, two-and-a-half-year-old DeMarco and six-month-old Annabella. Now, listen to how this is affecting Tabitha. When I met Wesley six years ago, I never imagined that he would deny both of our kids. All I've ever wanted is to be a family with Wesley. I've loved him so much, and all he's done is break my heart. He's kicked me and our kids out three times with nowhere to go, and it's not fair to them. When, when did he start denying DeMarco? When I was pregnant, he insisted that there was a guy in our town that looked just like him with blonde hair that I slept with. Um, he kicked me out three days later. Three days later, I went into labor for our son. He showed up at the hospital drunk. You know what a lot of people are saying right now? If he were to accept your child the first time, how come you got pregnant with him again? I love him, Maury. I love him. He's my kid's dad. You love him? I love him with all of my heart. I love him. I love that man. You love that? Do you love that man right now? Yes. Yes. I you do. want to be with him right now? More than anything. I want my family to be together. And yet he denies the second one. Yep, he denies the second one. Yeah. Now, what, what did he say about the second one? What, the same guy around town? He insisted that because I was a dancer, she's not his. Oh, because you were a dancer? Uh-huh. Now it was time to hear all of Wesley's reason for denying both of Tabitha's kids. Tabitha, I'm so positive that I'm not the father of your two kids that I called the show myself. I love those little kids, but be honest with yourself. I'm not the father. Throughout our whole relationship, you was a promiscuous hoe. When this test proves that I'm not the father, I'm moving away, and I don't ever want to hear from you again. <laughs> Have a seat. Wesley, sit down. Really? You you called the show. Yeah, I called the show. Huh? Yeah, yeah. I called the show. I called the show because when DeMarco was uh when he was born, right. I would have got a DNA test myself, but I was busy, you know, uh with right. the with the rent, with the rent and stuff. I didn't have I didn't have the funds for that. Right. Okay. But then the little baby was born, right? right? Little baby, your daughter. The baby. Your daughter. The baby was born. The that ain't my daughter. Annabella. That ain't my daughter. That you named. Man, you... Wesley, she's still in love with you. I know she's still in love with me. Are you in love with her? No. I'm How not you in gonna love with sign her. the birth certificate of a baby that ain't yours? I was, huh? I was Both drunk. Of them. I was drunk. I was drunk. So was Wesley the father of these two beautiful children? It was time for the paternity results. 
when it comes to two and a half year old DeMarco. Wesley, you are the father. <laughs> I to hear that. And, 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 and like I said, I, I like handle I the said, financial responsibility. I don't want you know? your financial responsibility. I want you involved. Yeah. And when it comes to six month old Annabella Wesley, you are the father. I want you to see them, Wesley. And I want you to apologize to them for every time that you're denied them. For every time that they were sick and you weren't there to uh, make them feel like better. I said, I'll do it, but I'm not gonna be with you. Apologize right now. Hi, baby. <laughs> Hi, Dad. Nice song. I love you. <laughs> All right, we'll be back right after this with more. <laughs> Eternity this hot could only happen during spring break. <laughs> Shell slept with her husband's best friend on their wedding night. I know Serenity's not dark like me, but I really do believe that she's mine. Is her husband the father? <laughs> Special Spring Break DNA Drama. Paternity this hot could only happen during spring break. There you go. Now, welcome back, everybody. We're taking a break from the cold and heating things up with some special spring break DNA drama. Here's a wedding photo of my next guest, Michelle, and her husband, Jamaric, on what should have been the happiest day of their lives. But instead of being blissful, both Michelle and Jamaric agree their wedding day was a complete disaster. So much so, it has brought them to our show in need of a paternity test. I felt like it was a sign that we shouldn't have gotten married because everything went wrong. I left and so did his best friend Chris. The honeymoon was definitely over for these two when Michelle then discovered she was pregnant. I was scared to death because I didn't know if it belonged to my husband or his best friend. What's the problem when we look at that screen, Michelle? <laughs> She's white. <laughs> My husband's black. Your husband told our producers that he keeps waiting for the baby to change. He does. He looks at her fingers every day <laughs> and just says they're going to get darker tomorrow. I swear they are. <laughs> he wants to be the father of this child. He loves her. Chris, this ex-best friend, <coughs> and Jameric coming to the wedding together. Then there was all kinds of things going on. People were late, they were late, other people were late. There was all kinds of knockdown drag outs at the My wedding. My mom wasn't there. So when it was all over, you went home and uh, you went back to the house, I guess, with Jameric, and you all started fighting again. Yes, it just got worse. And you said, I'm getting out of here. You slammed the door and left. Where'd you go? To Chris's house. Aww. What happened then? <laughs> we slept together. Oh! We spoke to Jamaric and Jamaric's ex best friend, Chris, and it was very clear Jamaric really wanted to be the father, and Chris was hoping he wasn't. Watch. When me and my wife Michelle got married, I thought we were going to have a happy and simple life together. I never thought that her and my friend will betray me the way they have. I warned you, Merrick, about Michelle and her slutty ways, and I told him not to marry her. But he didn't listen, so I slept with her to prove a point. When Michelle became pregnant, I just wanted to put the whole betrayal behind me and be there for the baby. Michelle says I'm the father of this baby, and I know it's very light. But she is such a whore that this could be any white man's baby. I know Serenity's not dark like me, but I really do believe that she's mine. I pray every night that I'm not the father of this baby. So I'm waiting on the DNA test to prove what I already know. If the test comes back negative, I'll be hurt, but I'll still be there for her. She's my little girl regardless. Before we could meet Chris, 
we had to bring Michelle's husband, Jamaric, out onto the set and give him a chance to tell his side of the story. How much can I say it's for real that you're going to stay around here with this marriage and this child if you're not the father? Definitely. Yeah. Yeah. So do you think there's a possibility that you're the father of this child? Very strong possibility. Really? Her, her feet are shaped the same way as mine. Uh -huh. you know, long, slender toes, right. odd shaped at the bottom. This is not a foregone conclusion with you. you... I'm holding my position strong regardless. Even if it turns out that it's not my baby, She's gonna have someone consistent in her life regardless. There was one person still to bring out, and that was Jamaric's ex-best friend, Chris. And after all he did to Jamaric, he still had a few harsh words left. Chris, they look at you as the bad guy here, I guess. Yep. Would you prefer to be friends with him? Nope. Why wouldn't you want to be a friend of his again? I don't know. He thinks I'm the bad person about the whole situation when it wasn't. It takes two. It's just as much your fault as it was mine. You shouldn't have stepped past that boundary. Well, you, 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 you should have tried to turn a home into a housewife. Think that's your child. That's possibility. I'm hoping it's not. No. You think it's Jamaric's child? No. <laughs> There's no telling whose it is. If it does turn out to be we'll his, there will be child support. What's that got to do with you? What's that got to do with you? It's you will take care of your responsibility. It just shows how stupid you are getting on stage with a white baby. It shows how stupid you are. So now it was time for the DNA results. In the case of three-week-old Serenity, Jamaric, you are not the father. <laughs> Case of three week old Serenity, Chris, you are the. <laughs> all we care about, oh, all you should care about, Come all you we care already about. said we're going to support some. She got a daddy. You're going to raise, you you, you're gonna, you're gonna raise this child. You're going to raise this child. Huh? I got, I got this. I got the job. I got this. You got it. I got it. You're going to take care of her? You all going to stay Lord. together? I married my wife to marry her because I love her. I don't care what he said. I got my I got my family together. What does he have? Okay. What does he have? Come on. Don't oh, nobody call the truth on nothing I told you. You keep your legs closed, wouldn't that be a problem? But if you wouldn't have stepped in. Whoa, 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 whoa. I'm sorry, son. We'll have more from the Weston Diplomat Resort and Spa in Hollywood, Florida. Next. Eternity this hot could only happen during spring break. Jasmine's hell bent on proving Brian's the dad to Brian and his mom. You're not here. Shut up. Shut up! Is he the father? Brian? <laughs> Special spring break DNA drama. <laughs> you are the father. Get off my stage! <laughs> Paternity this hot could only happen during spring break. Spring break DNA, and we're bringing it to you from a hot spot in South Florida. Maybe the hottest, the best, the Western Diplomat Spa and Hotel in Hollywood, Florida. Now, do you all remember a 19-year-old named Jasmine? Now, for two years, Jasmine was in love with this man, Brian. But it all ended when Brian began to deny their 15-month-old daughter, Jemiah. Now, there were two reasons for his denial of this baby. One of them was his meddling mother, Natalie. Watch this. 
Brian and I were having sex for exactly one month before I got pregnant with my daughter, Jemiah. He vowed that he would take care of my baby like he takes care of the rest of his kids. All that changed when his bitch of a mother stepped in the way. She has the nerve to say that Brian isn't the father of my baby. Brian has six different babies, so how can she say my baby isn't his? I'm 100% sure that Brian's the father of my child, and if not, I'm the Virgin Mary herself. So you all were close, right? Me and Brian were, yeah. Huh? For the first month, we messed around. I got pregnant. You know what he said, Maury? What? Well, if it's my baby, I want you to have it. I take care of all of my kids. Not true. You was there for a whole year and a half. Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! nothing like the rest of his kids. When you got three different baby mamas, all your kids ain't gonna look alike. All three of his kids look alike. If all, all of his kids was by the same woman and the baby came out looking kind of odd, then you can question that. But three different baby mamas, come on now, you ain't got the nerve to question nothing. When we spoke with Brian and his mom, Natalie, they had a very different story. Okay, Brian. Brian. You call my son and tell him he wasn't your right. baby's father. Cause he she wanna got act a like daddy. he ain't. I'ma tell him he not. But guess what? You the daddy. You the daddy. Nah. Who that baby? Nah. 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 Yeah. Why? Say no again Why and watch the results smack you in your face. I'm going to keep it just like this. And she was doing her thing when me and her was doing it. Right. The first night I came, the first night I spent the night I... You see what I'm saying? Who name is yeah. setting on you? This trap. All of that. So all of that for you. Get the show up. Get the show up. Get the show up. Chill out. Chill out. Back up. Back up, Jasmine. Wait a second. Wait a second. I want to talk to you. This beautiful little girl is yours. Are you going to be a grandmother to her? Yes, but th through courts, through the court, because her... All right, can you ask him one question? What? If it ain't your baby, why was you there for a whole year and a half? If she ain't yours. <laughs> so, would Jasmine finally prove to Brian and his mother, Natalie, that Brian was her baby's father? Watch. When it comes to 16-month-old Jemiah, Brian, you are the father. <laughs> All right, everybody, grab a cool drink. Things are about to heat up. We'll be back right after this. Eternity this hot could only happen during spring break. She's missed out on everything. She was staying out late, coming home with hickeys on her neck. I know this is not my child. Ron. Special spring break DNA drama. Mark. during spring break. <laughs> now, who could forget Cindy? When Cindy married Ron, she thought she'd found the man of her dreams. And a few months after getting married, Cindy says Ron begged her to have his child, begged her. But eight months into her pregnancy, Ron shocked her and filed for divorce. Watch. Ron was very excited when I first found out that I was pregnant. When I was eight months pregnant with our daughter, he walked out of me for good. And ever since he's denied our child, Ron has done absolutely nothing for my child. How old is your daughter? 
A year. A year? A year old. Never saw her. Never, has not seen her once. He told everybody I cheated on him. Be scared of having children. Then don't produce them. Why are you making babies? Don't produce them. Don't produce them. Don't, you know why? I didn't lay down, I didn't lay down to make this baby myself, and I should not have to take care of her myself. Now, when we spoke to Ron, he painted a very different picture here. When I met Cindy, I married her thinking everything was going to be great. But five months after we got married, I had a gut feeling she was cheating on me. She was staying out late, coming home with hickeys on her neck, and then finally she told me she was cheating on me. I know this is not my child. Here's Ron. Ron, come on out. Yeah, I told, I told you I was Every cheating. Day. I never Every told day. you I cheated. You Every always day. said it to me. You're Every the one here right now with your girlfriend Every out day. here, right? But I'm cheating. That's but your sister, your sister's yeah. cheating. Oh, you got yeah. two sisters now? Yeah. You haven't done anything for the child, right? What I pay I support. Oh. Look, he says I pay for, or I pay child support. You pay support. You ain't there for guidance. You ain't there for love. Why didn't you you the ain't attorney? there to sit there. Well, why you ain't you there to the sit there and help me with her. My mom and my dad are the ones helping me. They're not. I told her, let's do the paternity test as soon as the baby okay, was she, born. Why'd why you wait a week? You why didn't you wait a year? I'm the Ron, one that called the why show. Why didn't you wait if a year? This child, if this child is yours, you'll get in this child's life every day. So, was Ron the father? It was time for the DNA results. In the case of one-year-old Sierra, Ron, you are the father. <laughs> That's all I want to know. Okay, then. That's all I want to know. Okay. It's very simple, though. Know. You want him to be it? He wants to be in her life? That's yes. fine. Case closed. It's over. Right. We're in more DNA drama down south when we come back. <laughs> Turnity this hot could only happen during spring break. Yeah! Trina's furious. Keith denies her daughter. I have no spiritual aura with this baby at all. Keith. I'm not going to say to him. Special spring break DNA drama. <laughs> you are the father. Get off my stage. Paternity this hot could only happen during spring break. <laughs> now, recently, we met Trina. Four months ago, Trina gave birth to a beautiful baby boy named Keith. Now, Trina was so madly in love with her baby's father, Keith, that she named her son after him. But one month after baby Keith, the third, was born, Keith packed up his stuff left Trina and the baby. First, we heard from Trina. Boy, I've got the proof right here. I've got the proof right here. What? Look at that. Come on in. You come on in. You come on in. You come on in. I've got the proof right here. What, what, you what? asked if Trina, it to be named Trina, after you. Trina. You asked for it to be named. What do you mean? What, yes, what? baby. Name our son after me. I will be honored to have a real keep instead of a phony because he names all his kids after him and then he turns around and denies them. Now it was to hear all of Keith's unusual reasons for denying Trina's son. Trina's nothing but a gold digging hoe. First night I met her, I had sex with her. That should tell you what type of girl she is. If it was that easy for me, it should tell you how easy it was for everybody else. And when that baby came out, it came out with an extra finger. One, two, three, four, five, five fingers. So you know that baby ain't came from me. And on top of that, I have no spiritual aura with this baby at all. That baby looks nothing like me. To make matters worse, she named him after me, and I never gave her permission to use my name. And when the test proved that I'm not the father, I want my name back from your six-finger baby, and I want you to leave me the hell alone. Let's go. Let's go. Let's do this. Here. Let's go. Here's Keith. Bring him out. Let's Here's Keith. So, was Keith the father of little Keith the third? Here are the paternity results. When it comes to four-month-old Keith the third, Keith, you are the father. <laughs> what? 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 <laughs> we'll have more DNA drama when we come back. Woo!